Okay, so this is my method of getting a, a tire seated. And this is a smaller tire, so I'm gonna actually have to stretch, stretch the tire just a little bit. And you can see the gap that I have to cover. So this tire is a little small for this rim. Um, so I have that little bit of gap to, to get it up into just like that. So my little technique is just to get this side beaded. Get it all the way seated up there. And then I basically have to uh, set it down on the ground and then just push it down, push the tire down evenly all around so it gets enough uh, contact with the bead and, and so enough air can, can give it some pressure and it'll just pop back on. I've done this a couple times. I don't know if this works every time on every tire, but uh, this is the way I've done it. Uh, so far so usually I use dish soap or uh, soapy water when I put the tire back on because then that that will evaporate I noticed that uh, it's easier when I set it on the old tire that I took off I set it on that so it has a little bit even pressure all, all around as I push down on the tire and uh, so that just kind of gives it a an easy stretch around the tire Hopefully that makes sense, but it might make more sense when I do it. There you go, it worked. Third time doing it. I've never seen it on YouTube, so I don't I haven't seen a video yet, so I don't know if it's not known or if I just haven't found it yet.